time and we have got the big boys this is for the strap in the light heavyweight division we've got Carl Reardon perfect 3-0 record taking on Paulius Perkunas Zabinskas Perkunas is the Lithuanian god of lightning will lightning strike tonight your referee for this main event is Mario Stomasat, just giving the fighters final instructions. Zamingas is in the Shaolin MMA orange rash guard, taking on Carl Reardon in the black rash guard, wearing the SPG gray shorts. Big difference in body composition here. Zabinska, the, the more thick set guy. And both, both fighters possess power. They have knockout and TKOs on the records. Nice sharp jab from Carl. And you can just see Zabinkas working his way in off the jab and the leg kicks. He's looking to load up on everything here at the moment. Some nice movement though from Zabinska. Trying to stay light on his toes. And they'll spin a Rooney there. Oh. Nice front kick by Reardon. Landed on the chin. Zabinkas wore it though. Pushing Reardon up against the cage. You'd have to think that uh, Zabinska would have the, the strength advantages here based on the, the body composition. Like I said, we saw it earlier earlier in the in the night. That big, thick, heavy set body type can tend to wear down. Good work by Reardon to get himself away from the cage. Zabinka sustained on a beautiful knee to the body. Just when that separation was there, corner corner for separations is in it. Zabinska is settled into this one. Reardon to nice, nice jab. That's what Reardon should be doing, popping out that jab, making him eat it. Keeping that one step distance in, make him eat the jab and out, get out of range. Nice fast jab as well. Just flicked it onto the chin of Zeminkas. That's it, keep lighting the toes and start pulling it out. Again, he's eating it, you can see the head rock back. Reardon starting to settle into this, lands a nice right hand as well. And he's just to alternate the speed, of, the, the speed of that jab. If he keeps on giving it, full, throwing a full throttle, he can be timed. Zeminkas seems to be throwing a lot into his shot, so again, a missed shot where he's thrown. It's gonna sap the energy as well. Well, Reardon seems to be more control of the power that he's putting on, the power percentage he's putting on his shot, so trying to stuff the head here. Zabinka's up against the cage again. Good work as well, just landing the knees, constantly working, making Reardon work. Old-fashioned foot stomp by Reardon. Marius Thomas just calling for action. So Zabininskas is going to know that Marius is coming in. He's going to have to do something to keep this position. Stuffing the forehead under the chin of Reardon. And on some knees, but is it enough for Marius to keep them nice, standing? Nice turn, nice turn out there. And Carl Reardon got back to the well there with the jab. Zabinska, I think, is going to be looking for those leg kicks to load up on them. Reardon is just working behind that jab, but this time Zabinska just closes the distance again. Looking to change levels, but good work by Reardon, not allowing it. I'd like to see Reardon break the angle and start moving off to the side, because Zabinska is just like a, a bull in a china shop. He's just charging forward with everything. So if, he, if, he's able to, if Reardon's able to break those angles, he'll take that, away, take that out of uh, Zabinska's arsenal, and you'll have to, to, you'll have to ch change it up and take it something else. That first round seems to have flown in. That was a 10-second clapper. On the break, Zabinka's trying to land it. Step away, left hook. And Reardon again going for that front kick. He's gone for it a couple of occasions. Mario Stomasat just clearing out the cage here for your second round in your championship bout main event here at Cage Legacy 9. Carl Reardon taking on Polius Zabinskas. Second round underway. 
And Zabinza has gone back to that. He's, he's done it a few times where he misses the low kick, spins, spins and throws around. the right hand after it. Exactly, and Carl should be following up with that. As soon as he does that spin around, he's just watching for the spin and back fist out of it, but he should be capitalising. Because anything after that, when that kick misses that leg, everything after that is just excess movement. He should be punishing that. Zabinza is trying to close the distance, but Rin, good nice. cage management and distant management there. Good to see him breaking the angle. Just step across either to the left or the right with his footwork and land the counter. Mm. I'd like to see Carl throw straight right down the pipe. Mm. Zubinsk is very clever here, very clever here in the strategy. Stuffing the work really of Reardon, not allowing Reardon to use that jab. So starting to blow heavy though a little is Zubinskis. Nice body work there by Reardon. But Reardon is it, he's almost just turned this into a boxing match. He's just working behind the jab. He needs to do a little bit more, I feel. Like I said, to open up that head, he needs to, to make him think about something else. There's that straight right I was asking for. And that's what he's doing. He's working behind the jab, but he's got to follow up with that second strike. And again, yeah. Zabinkas just closes the distance, smothering the work again of Reardon. Heavy weight of Zabinsk is just being thrown on Reardon here, and this is an exhausting yeah, position not, in not, MMA. He's not doing much here now at the moment, but he's just making Carl Reardon. I think it's more for it, for Zabinsk to get a break as opposed to do any real damage. He looks like his arms are, arms are getting heavy now. Yeah, that was dropping lower to his yeah. waist, and I'd like to see yeah. Reardon. He went high with a kick yeah. earlier in the fight. I'd like to see him implement that again. Nice uppercut and left hook off it as well, and Reardon is starting to light him up. Big right hands, two Zabinsk's or three big up. shots. Again, that, that, that leg kick, he's, and he's, he's loading on it as well, so it's going to take a lot of him in terms of fatigue when he misses it. Reardon has just brought it into his range, and there's oh, a big oh, head kick! kick. Zabinskis wears it, but Reardon turning the pressure up. Zabinskis has got a chin, he just took a kick on the chin and still standing. And Reardon just really using fundamentals to He'll work his opponent and then light him up with some good combinations and that head kick, I still don't know how he's standing. It's like he was just he was trying to wait for him to be fatigued and now he's starting to put the work on him. And the hands are dropping very low. Well, that's oh, the big is. shot drop, Zabinski, and walk that's it. Walk off, walk off, good stoppage, walk off, knockout by Carl Reardon. It was enough, Zabinski was going out on his shield. Big combinations, I called for more, I wanted to see more behind the box and he done that and he threw that head kick up, that was the start of the end, Richard Guiley. It was, and like I said, I was calling for that straight right earlier in the fight, but it, he started implementing it in as uh, Zabinska started to get the fatigue, and he's, like you said, that left height. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, referee, Mr. Myers, Donald Sellers, Connor, stop the reaction at 2 minutes and 49.